Wedding prep. Wedding prep. So this is what I'm taking to Scotland, Helen. But it is. It's you can Thursday. leave it here because I love it. It's Thursday. They're getting married on Saturday. Wow. Well, I've been trusted to take this all the way to Inverness. You be careful. Lions. Is that a lion and a lioness? Yeah, that's the lion. That's the lioness. Yeah. And there's God. I think that's that Noah. Signature. We see any airbrushing, and it's got that on. That's Adam. And Adam is going to be doing all my airbrushing. Airbrushing? What airbrushing? You said you weren't having an airbrush. You said it was finished. George Rail video. Oh, my transport manager sent me a video. We need to get that Volvo in there that's just been airbrushed that Darren's still building up onto this trailer and get it up to Inverness tonight. And it is now 10 to 1 in the afternoon. It looks a bit nervous. Yep. The Ark had an aerial, didn't it? Did it? Yeah, of course it did. What, they had CBs on Noah's Ark, did they? Of course they did. I'm strapping on and you're still building up? Yes. How's your career change to cameraman? Uh. <laughs> took many years of practice to get that tucked in there like that. Wow. Quite a lot of stuff. No, look, I've got well, lights and tidy as well, isn't it? Well, what <laughs> 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 No, don't try. Come, come. <laughs> we are all strapped on, ready for Inverness. I'm looking forward to taking this one up the road. It's a nice truck. It is now two o'clock in the afternoon and we're going all the way to Inverness. I never actually got a reload of DAF tomorrow to bring back down to the yard and I'm stopping off to get my torsion bar done. It looks like a very expensive fox, if I'm honest. Hello, mate. What's your name? George. What horsepower you got there? 580. Three, two, one, go! See ya! <laughs> uh, you can see the tyre marks where we've gone. <laughs> Lorry spun it out. Wheel trims off, airbags out. Slingshot! How's it going? Oh, I got you You're headed to Scotland? I am, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to Scotland, but not to the show. No, I'm at Truck Fest. You're, yeah, I'm not going to Truck Fest. No. I'm just delivering this. Yeah. See you yeah, later. Yeah. It's the driver of Slingshot. Awesome. All of this traffic is really hampering progress. God, it's going to be a late night, guys. We're going to be going until the early hours of this morning. So we're at Scotch Corner now. I need to stop for a comfort break. We shall just check our straps. Right, let's do a bit more. Woo. Across the 66 we go. It's a lovely road. We've been going three hours, 55 minutes now. I'm hoping I'm gonna to get to the Burger King on the M6. It's definitely headwind, can you hear it? So noisy, it's hampering my fuel consumption, no end. It's time for a Burger King. I do love Burger King. Let me know in the comments what your favourite is. Burger King, McDonald's or KFC. Ah. <sighs> this last minute is always the longest. 45 minutes complete. Now let's get on up to Inverness. Hey, welcome to Scotland. Woo! still have another 256 miles, four hours, 10 minutes, but that's in a car, so it's gonna be about four and a half hours. We're just 
skirting around Glasgow at the moment. Still got about another three hours to go. I just had a great idea. Put purple underglow on. It now matches the Volvo on the back. We want the A9. Average speed, cameras. Still got two hours to go. Lovely little old jump. Inverness A9. Into the night, into the Scottish hills. Absolutely love it. That's a bit rough out there now. We've got rain, wind, rocking around all over the shop. Hour to go, hour. So we're now on the back roads. We're gonna park up where we parked up last time when we had the Digger Girls truck on the back. I think this was the right way. Big potholes, big potholes, nice and steady. That will do donkey. Oh my God. Woo! We've arrived. I might need my night heater on. It's only 10 degrees out there. Oh, there's James. What about that? Night heater on in August. So the time now is half past midnight. We left the yard at 2 p.m. So we've not done too bad. We have cracked on up to Inverness. So I'm gonna get in my bed now. Nipper's gonna wake us up in the morning. We're gonna get this unloaded for William, who's getting married on Saturday. I'll see you in the morning, guys. Somebody is in the truck. I'll pick it up then. <laughs> what happened to my lights? It's a branch. There's a bit of twig up there. Oh. It Quarter is. Quarter past seven. And the black plastic securing devices are out. Again. Morning. Oh, morning. Oh, this is oh, Volvo sorry. Rescue oh, Service. Oh, sorry, sorry. Morning, Mr. Volvo. Sorry. What did we call it today? Branch. Well, that's a big daisy chain. Yes. Oh, this this <laughs> Malcolm! You've been colouring. Yes, I've had a long day. <laughs> oh, yeah. I like the smoke. I mean, that one. <laughs> I think that one right there. Yeah. The problem is, when it rains, mm. they sit lower. Oh, yeah. yeah and of, of course, course. you're going to be thinking about it. No, I wanted to get parked up. <laughs> Ah, long day yesterday. Look at the stags. And the stacks. There it is. Tell you one thing. I'd like to say safely delivered, but... Yeah. All the best tomorrow. Yes, Good luck. You. Behave yourself. Yes, we will. Oh. I shall meet you at the... Ballonuit. Ballonuit Services, where we stopped before. <laughs> Ballingway Services. I think that's how you say it. I need some fuel because we are nearly empty, we're in the red. So we've used the whole tank to get up and about an hour and a half back. We'll put it in here beside this one. This looks expensive. Oh, it does. 600 pounds. <laughs> Stop. That'll get you to the fence. Actually, you owe me a tank of diesel. Yes. Well, you owe me a tank, so. Yeah, but I'll give you a tank. Have you give me. So a we're, we're right then. No, you no. owe me a tank. So now you're back owing me one. I can pay for this one. No, it's all right. It's okay. Done now. Video should cover it. <laughs> yeah, the video. Oh. Just gonna say. Just gonna say. Alexander. He's got a lorry. How old are you? Yeah. Six, and you've got a lorry. Can we see it? Wow, look at that. Do you polish it and drive it around the yard? Good boy. I'm the truck nest, you know the I one see that you Oh yeah, well, you see uh, that? Yeah, thank you for the diesel, goodbye. I was supposed to be going to truck nest, but I double booked. We have a full tank of fuel. Oh, qu'est-ce que c'est? Uh-oh.
I like sitting beside Lara's in traffic. You get the reverberations. Bit more. Boom. You can just see the fourth row bridge just through there though. I think that might be the reason we're going so slow. Because it's the school holidays, you got all the tourists and they all want to have a little look at the fourth road bridge, including me. I want to look at the fourth road bridge too, because I am kind of a tourist, working tourist. Can you call this work? It's Truckfest Scotland this weekend. I'm so close to it, but I just can't be there. I'm sorry, I got far too much on. Next year I'll be at Truckfest Scotland. I bet everyone's like, oh, Tim's up here, Tim's coming. I'm not. <laughs> I'm tricking you, I'm not coming. Look at this road. Whoa. This is like a roller coaster. This is a big one. Here we go. Point nine meters. Well, I won't get under that. Oh, just to say, we're here. What? Gates locked. Nobody in. I better ring the load organizer. Nipper. There is a man. Well done, Nipper. Thank you. Here she comes. The DAF 2500 is out of the shed. Four series there, look. Probably do some bits off that. It's got fold out steps. Ooh. 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 This is a bit of me, this isn't it? It's got fold out steps on it. Them fold out steps are like hen's teeth. Here he comes. We're loaded. Now we're going down to Graham Commercials, Scania Specialists, to have my torsion bar fixed. A bit tight across this bridge here. So we bought an old Volvo up and we're taking an old daft back. Living the dream. I think there's some truck spotters on this bridge. I've been to Assen, Sydney, been abroad, been up here twice to Scotland, done lots of local work, been down to London and around everywhere basically. And literally, touch wood, I've not had any problems with my truck. See, I really think I bought a good truck. This is just set up, this is. This is my new torsion bar, new pedestals. This looks like a very expensive box, if I'm honest. Because the threads are, what do they call it? Helicoil. Helicoil. Is that what they are in there? Yeah. But they shouldn't look like that. Will it drive a bit better with this new bar? It should do. It was a bit knocky on bumps when you... It should be. Bom, 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 bom. be a lot better. Can I check the back of the cab? All right, go on. Yeah. This is my old one. Is this actually knackered or not? We'll probably check that away and Ooh. do some good You could probably sort it out and sell it. Lovely. I suppose that's a good old daft. People keep saying that's a booty you've got on there, so. You're giving me a, a job. Thank you. Ooh. Drive through torsion bar change. It's all shiny. Makes me want to keep going now. Put all new other new bits on it. Make a rest restoration. Ooh. Yep, that's in. <laughs> <laughs> It's very efficient. I have noticed there's two of you working on it. Does that mean I've got to pay double labour? There we go, all new shiny parts. 
that cost uh, a little bit. Done. Oh, what's your name, mate? Lachlan. Hang on. Huh? Lachlan. Lachlan? You've just gave me this. Thank you very much. I've been looking for them for ages. Thank you. Absolutely awesome service from Graham Commercials. Literally done that in an hour. Swapped the whole torsion bar over and new pedestals. That was a very expensive hour. It was bad, it needed doing. If that broke, the cab airbags can fly out and poof, through your grill. That would not be a good day. Stick around till the end of the video. I'll show you the invoice for that work we've just had done. It wasn't cheap. We are going to drive that T-cab very soon, guys. It looks like he's going up to the show. We're going down to meet him. We're going to do some cool stuff, take that T-cab out for a drive. So don't want to miss that. Hit the subscribe button. Turn on the bell notification so you don't miss it. Also, if you're enjoying this video so far, guys, please give it a like. Oh, we're still going. It is what's the time now? 11 p.m. Underglow is fully lit. So I'm almost out of time. Does that mean I can put my beacons on? The big problem is that you're the turning the blue lights on. There's one thing for sure. This isn't getting unloaded tonight. Nipper's trailer isn't here because he's at Truckfest Scotland. Well, there we go. We've made it back safely. I don't want to shout too loud because Andy is actually asleep in his truck over there. The turbo intercooling daft got back safely all the way down from Edinburgh. So we've been up to Inverness and all the way back down. Andy's asleep in there. Oh, good morning. So we managed to get it started. We hot wired it. Just bridged across the connections with a. Uh, where's the key? Here's the key. I'll just back this off then. Another forward. Hey! Oh yeah! Is this not got power steering? Is this how heavy the steering was back then? <laughs> oh, that's too high gear. What gear was that? See, look, there's no instructions. Oh my god. Steering is so. You'll go, mate. How do you stop it? Stall it. Stall it. That's the right one. That worked. Well, it's better than I thought it would. Might need a new ignition barrel. That is one DAF 2500 safely delivered. Now, how much was that front torsion bar? I have the invoice here. Truck parts aren't cheap. Here is my invoice. Cash sale, trucker Tim. So the two upright turrets were £434 each. Then we had the anti-roll bar, £1,654. Luckily I only need one of those. And then it got various things like bump stops, two of them at £41. And well, it's all there. Look, two link yokes, whatever they are, they were £115 each. Parts, £2,933. Labour, £185. A total of £3,742.33p. But I did get a free cab tilt bar. Woo! Nice! So we're going to take this trailer back to Sean's now, drop it off, and then I think that's a job well done. Whoa! Gah. What are we doing now? I'm going to put a new fifth wheel on. There we go, look at that! Why are we having a new fifth wheel? Oh, God. I wasn't expecting this today. 
with that paintbrush cleaning up under it if we put a new fifth wheel on seriously are you gonna be long or what i want to get on, on you want to get on yeah i have lighting issues might be a few more than lighting issues tim oh